Y'all uh, getting ready for the party here? What did you say? I just asked if y'all are getting ready. Yeah, you just called an Uber, you coming? Um, I'm not sure yet. No, I'm not sure yet. I wanted to make something my sophomore year of college and it was like two weeks before spring break and I knew I wanted to film over spring break and I thought I was on a college campus so it should be about college and then it ended up kind of just being about my relationship with this girl that I dated for like three years and so that was kind of the college and this relationship. Am I not allowed to sleep here? No, you can. Am I like keeping you up? Oh no, no, I wasn't, I wasn't sleeping. Do you want to like go hang out? Yeah. Yeah, I'd, I'd love to. Well, I didn't really produce it, but I did mentor Cooper through the process. And the way that I came on board was super unusual. I, I got a, t someone tweeted at me <laughs> and said, I dare you to watch this movie. And I was like, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna start watching it and I'm gonna turn it off after three minutes when it's unbearable. <laughs> and this is the homemade movie that Cooper made with his actual girlfriend at the time that precedes this one that we're talking about. So I'm the one who tweeted him and I basically stalked Jay and I found out that he had a bad first year and made a movie uh, that he would have no choice but to like. So you're a sophomore, right? Yeah. Did you have a tough first year? What do you mean, like adjusting? Can I tell you a secret? I have zero friends. <laughs> like you could say my roommate is a friend. Sam, we need to get up. I didn't do nothing. You dropped a deuce in our room. Okay. Yeah. But. We hate each other and aren't friends. My girlfriend wasn't an actress and, uh, and nobody in that first original movie was an actor. So I kind of, I, the second time around, I wrote a script knowing that there was gonna be some people with some acting chops and that was really exciting. And I felt like I didn't have that limitation. Oh my God, you sent her so many messages. Hey, what's going on? Hey, see you. Are you sure that that was um, the girl? Yeah. It just seems like she didn't, know that you existed. I was not shy with Cooper along the way in terms of writing and in terms of editing in particular. Like I, I showed up a few days on set, but mostly production was him, but definitely very involved in writing and editing and helping him through that. And I was just like, yeah, I know that's what you think, but in two or three weeks, you're gonna come back and you're gonna tell me why this needs to happen and, and that's okay. And he was like, Okay, and then he'd come back two or three weeks later and be like, yeah, that's what needs to happen. Why do you want to just go back to what you were doing? Did you think we were going to date because of one night? Most young filmmakers don't understand yet that uh, filmmaking is like a communication process with the audience that doesn't, that you don't have access, access to yet. And so the biggest part of your process is really trying to experience it from their perspective. And Cooper has that mindset and that mentality. And I just thought it had a ton of heart. I thought it was funny. I thought it showed a lot of promise. And I felt like it was the college movie that should exist that's never existed. The agenda here is not to learn how to be a great friend. What is the agenda? Figure out who you are. Figuring out who you are separate from other people.